All right. So it is March 8th at 1.08 p.m. Uh, I had the opportunity to observe your second hour, eighth grade um, algebra lesson. Let's just go ahead and start off on what that was about a little bit. What was it about? Yeah. Did you say? Mm -hmm. um, it was about input and output tables. We were beginning to study functions and to find patterns in the input and output to start writing equations. I noticed you used a lot of different um, like learning or learning resources during that lesson. Why did you pick those like resources in particular? Um, part of it was because the illustrative math curriculum gives you a whole lot of different pr digital print. Um, they have a bunch of mathematical practices, so all of those require something different to use. So um, I use that as my guide, and so mm -hmm. I pick the tools they give me. Okay, good. What is one thing that you did made you feel like is most effective in the lesson? Variety was probably good because they saw things at different, you know, they saw it in print version, they saw it um, digital, we were able to use an applet, and so I think that was helpful for them to see things in a different light. Yeah, I agree, because I like how you went like whole classroom, and then you had them work in pairs, and then we went back to whole classroom, and then they did it individually too. So I think that variety, like what you mentioned, was really helpful. Um, well, I believe strongly in partner talk and that when they can talk to their partner, whether they're right or wrong, mm -hmm. that they're using math vocabulary and they're gaining a lot of insight into how somebody else thinks mm -hmm. and maybe they'll change over to that way or they'll convince somebody to think their way. Yeah. Bringing up the partner talk, before the lesson, you want me to kind of make note of just like how well they were like discussing during their like partner work time. Um, what strategies did you use to like work effectively on to, like, to promote that a little bit? I didn't do it the way I probably should have. I didn't, I just jumped into this curriculum and mm -hmm. partner talk was a big part of it. Okay. So they have just done it from the beginning of the year. Okay. So next year probably, mm -hmm. I maybe need to work on that or tell them what it looks like. Um, and every class is different in the way. That class is really quiet, mm -hmm. and they might be partner talking, but you can't hear it. Yeah, so like I have to say, like when you actually look around, they are discussing and working through the problems together, uh, which, is, which is awesome. Um, moving forward, so if you were to do this lesson again, what things will you do the same? If you could change it up anyway, how would you change it up? Um, and then kind of going back to that whole class participation, is there anything you want to change? to like, increase that or bump that up? Well, I tried, I did change it after second hour. I did um, the paper input output where somebody had, mm -hmm. they were the function machine and they gave, okay. you know. I switched it and did that first before we did the applet and it mm -hmm. was a disaster. <laughs> so then I had to switch back to, okay, I, so doing the, the digital version first and then the paper one was better. Um, I don't think I'll change any of the whole, like start out with your individual, then go to your partner, and then go to whole group, because uh -huh. that's pretty much how yep. the curriculum's developed, mm -hmm. and that I'm supposed to, there's, I'm just facilitating, and then at the end I tie it all together. Yep. So I think that's probably as effective as I could have gotten it in this lesson. Yep. The for, is this your first year with the uh, math curriculum, the online yes. math curriculum? Yes. Um, what, how do you, what do you like about that like technology usage compared to like prior years? I like the applets that they have in there. Mm -hmm. What I love about the program is the same thing I hate about the program. It, go, it breaks it down really, really well, mm -hmm. but then I feel like we're going so slow that I'm not making very much progress. Gotcha. So, but um, it, it has a lot more rigor than I used to have. And once our sixth and seventh grade uses it, and then I don't have to fill in so much because I have to Good. spend a lot of time backfilling, trying to get them up to where this curriculum starts. All right. I think that'll do it. So thank you. Thanks.